so hello guys welcome back this is viren kumar so today in this video session i'm going to discuss about how we can create the folder structure and how we can organize the pipelines in the azure devops sometimes we have created a lot of pipelines that could be the continuous integration pipeline or the release pipelines under the pipeline sections and there may be a lot of pipelines available for the use okay and the pipeline size will increase by 100 200 300 we don't know in that situations we want to organize these pipelines based on the uses so some pipelines we want to organize based on the build and some pipelines we want to organize based on the release pipelines so in that conditions what we can do we can create the folder structure for the pipelines under the project and the folder structure will give you the feasibility to use the pipelines and we can save the pipeline in the particular folder okay so on my screen you can see i have a many pipelines okay and these pipelines i, I don't know which pipelines i have used on what time okay that time i have renamed the pipelines but i need to scroll down and i need to search the pipeline for the use so come this time consuming process what you can do you can create the folder structure so as you can see i have the folder structure based on my requirement so when i started the basic yaml then i created the basic yaml folder and under that i have all the pipelines that i have used for the basic yaml demo site okay the second folder i have created for the deployment yaml folder so whatever pipelines i have used for the deployment purpose i have saved under this folder so like that i can search the pipelines which i want to use for the particular use so i no need to go here recent sections and i need to scroll down and search and i need to go and edit the pipelines so best thing is that you can use the folder structure so now how to create the folder structure the first way is you can come to the pipeline and go to the all okay under the all you have the new folder tab is there you can click the new folder so i am going to say this a demo folder okay and then you can create the folder now you can see that the demo folder is created here okay and under that pipelines you sorry under that folders you can save your pipeline so create a new pipeline here so you can start creating the pipeline here so which pipelines you want to go with the classic editor pipelines the yaml pipelines and you want to create the release pipelines so depends on pipelines you can create the folder structure here so like that you can create the folder structure under the pipeline section now you want to delete a particular folder so for that you can go to this folder and there you can see that more options is there so you click on that here you can rename the folder you can create a new pipeline you can from here also you can create a new folder and you can delete the folder so first let's create the sub folder for this one so this we call the sub folder so now you can create a sub folder here so if you go the demo folder under you have the sub folder is there under that you can start creating the pipeline now you want to delete this folder so for that i will go to the more options and from here i can delete so under there i need to type the folder name so you just copy now you cannot delete the folder okay so for that what you can do you need to select the whole path for this one so now you can delete the folder okay and now i'm going to delete the main folder for that i will go to the delete options and i can select the folder name okay slash folder name and then you can delete the folder so like that you can delete the folder so this is the one way by which you can create a new folder now let me show the second way so suppose you have the new project okay under the new project you have the pipeline sections 
and you have recent pipelines okay you have created few recent pipelines and you can go to the all now from the recent sections i can create the folder how i will go to the particular pipeline and once i am on the particular pipeline this is the pipeline name i will go to the more actions and there i have the rename and the move option is there under that i can type the folder name demo folder okay now you can save it now your pipeline is moved to the demo folder how i can check i will go to the all now the demo folder is created and under the recent if you can see this icon okay folder icon is there it will show you the folder name and this is your pipeline which you can find under this folder now from here <coughs> you can also delete the pipeline rename the pipeline and move the pipeline you can run the pipeline and you can edit the pipeline so like that you can create the folder and organize your pipeline based on the folders this is a very good practice to have the pipeline in a organized way and it will give you the feasibility to identify the particular pipeline for your use so i recommend you go and create the folder structure and then start creating your pipeline section and if still you didn't subscribe my channel please go and subscribe the channel i have the azure devops a whole playlist and the video session is there so you can go and watch and definitely you will get the idea about the job develop